and welcome to Heidi's Homemade Quilts and more. I'm Heidi. Hello. And uh, today I have some stuff to open up and show you. Um, this came from China. It's, a, it's diamond painting. Um, I believe that this one is from um, Diamond Express. So I actually ordered this back um, at like around New Year's and it just got here, um, I want to say Monday, um, today is Thursday so I did take a couple days, um, before I unboxed it here. I was waiting for some other stuff to come in that has not shown up yet either. So, let's see what we got here. All right, so this is the box that it came in. I've never seen this box before. It says, Angel's Hand. It says, DIY Diamond Painting. Um, otherwise, it's just kind of a generic box. This should have two kits in it because I ordered two kits from this company. Um, and I have a um, a shipping tracker that tracks everything. It's called Arrive. It tracks like everything that you order um, as long as you put in a tracking number. And it also like goes through your emails and picks up any tracking numbers. So it'll like add that to whatever, so you can have all of your tracking information in one little spot. It's nice. I like it. Arrive. And it's free. All right. So, okay. Everything came out in one big bundle. There you go. See the drills? All right. So, yep. There's two diamond paintings here. So, I'm going to carefully unroll this guy. So, there's diamond painting one. Okay, I'm going to set him to the side for a sec while I unroll the rest of it. Okay, so we have a drill kit and another drill kit. And here's diamond painting number two. All right, so we're going to start with this one, I guess, since it's in my hands. So yeah, so this is from Diamond Express. And it says it right on top there. Diamond Express. Obviously, it is double-sided tape. I have never ordered from this company before. So this is a new one for me. Um, looks like it's got some stuff here. Uh, let's see. He's got a little bit of crinkling on the bottom part here. Right there. See that? A little bit of crinkling. I don't think it really goes too much into the painting, so it should be okay. And I don't see any other problems. Looking at the back, it looks nice. I don't see any issues. Sometimes when they come rolled around the diamonds, they can create rivers. And it's one huge piece of tape. All right. Ooh. So, here is the image. So this is spices, is what I believe this one was called. And it's almost all the way off, so that's almost the entire image. It says it's a 40 by 40. We'll measure it in just a second. And then the drill field's pretty clear if my camera would focus. It might be as good as it's going to get. But the drill field's pretty clear, and there's no issues, no rivers, no, no anything like that. It's super sti sticky. My hair just stuck to it a little bit there. All right, let's see if I can get this back on there. Easy does it. Easy does it. All right. I get 
that back on there. Pull him up from the other side here for a sec. So I don't create my own rivers. My own bows. All right. So let's see. It says it's a 40 by 40. And yeah, he is 40, like one notch away from 40. By 40, yeah, like it's like one notch away from 40. So yeah, I would say it's 40. 40 by 40, it's a good size. I think it's an excellent size for the image. Let's take a look at the drills here. So it did come with two, well, two diamond paintings, so two, two kits. So two kits, exactly the same. Um, it's got a little square of wax, the clear, opaque, drill, a couple baggies, and a cheap pair of metal tweezers, the really sharp kind, and the white boat with a funnel. And they're both exactly the same. Okay? All right. So, this is an image of what that looks like. Yeah, I believe this one was called, whoa, hello, Spices. All right, so it's got an inventory sheet and it's got some, some hash, hashes on there showing that someone went through and verified. So there are, colors with the majority of it being 939 there's 16 bags of 939 okay so there's your inventory sheet the symbols are really hard to read on here some of them are so dark that you can't really tell what they are but you can tell that someone had gone through and marked them off so that's good that is always reassuring I did have one that I did last night into today and finished it um that was actually missing one bag of the one color that yeah there was only 24 drills on the whole thing of this color and it wasn't and it was wasn't there so i had to go into my stash of extra drills and find something that was comparable because i didn't have that exact number so but anyway whatever it wasn't from this company so it's okay so it does come with, I'm not going to pull all these out, but it comes with the drills that are in the stamped baggies. There's 154, and there's four of them. I believe there's like 250 in these little bags. Um, I think that's what they are. The drills themselves look really nice. I don't know if you can see that. One doesn't want to focus today. But there's they're really smooth on the back. I don't see any obvious trash or anything like that. It looks looks pretty good. And that's a dark color too, so let's look at a light color. Maybe that'll be easier to see. So here's 3042, light purpley color. Not one focus. But yeah, the drills look good. All right, so far, so far, so good. I don't see anything that worries me. Holy drills. I'm assuming this is that 9 3. Nine, 
It's like a bluish black. There's a lot of them, so I'm assuming that that is the one that there was like a ton of. All right, so that is the spices. Let's make sure that goes back in there so I don't lose that. That would be bad. Because there is no marking on this bag as to what is in this bag. Okay. Hopefully... I can get the problem I have when they put kits like this together in one box I can never get everything back in the box I end up putting just the canvases in the box and storing those separately than the diamonds I don't like it but you know whatever it just takes up more space serious you know better Stop that. No. He's not supposed to be on the couch. And that was a pillow from the couch, so yeah. All right, so that was canvas number one. Canvas number two is a little bit bigger. He is 40 by 50, okay? So he's slightly bigger. And let's see if I can peel him back to where we can see what this is gonna look like. So when I ordered these, I did use some kind of a discount. I don't remember what it, what it was. I think I might've clicked on something from like Instagram or something like that. So, whew, geez. All right. So, this one is an owl carrying a necklace with a pentagram on it. And it's a white owl. And I think the image is that it's a white owl and like snow, like blue sky and snow or something like that. It's very staticky. My hair is just like standing on end right now. I don't know if you're going to be able to see because my camera hasn't been focusing, but the drill field is nice and clear. Okay, let's see if I can get this tape cover back on. And we'll measure it, but the other one was like true to size. So I'm assuming this one's going to be true to size. But... You know what we get when we assume, and we don't want to do that. So, so far this is going on super easy. So I'm still waiting for my package to arrive that I ordered online from Joanne Fabrics of um, the clear um, film that they started carrying with the Diamond Dots brand. I ordered like six rolls of it because my local Joann's did not have it yet. And I wanted to go through some of these, especially these larger diamond paintings like this and recover them with the film. Um, hopefully making them last a little longer because you know I'm not going to get to these right away. That is not going to happen. So, um, but I'm still waiting. I ordered it on um, February 3rd, I believe. And I don't even know if it's been shipped yet. Um, I did log onto the app and it's not. Um, last time I logged in, it said that it, had, it was still in processing. Um, you know, they took the money out a month, over a month ago. But I digress anyway. Um, but as soon as that does arrive, this type of image is definitely going to get resurfaced because I want to make sure that it is in good condition when I go to use it. Because I will definitely want to do this one. 
and we'll show you the picture in a minute. But I'm going to measure it first. And he is supposed to be 40 by 50. And he is, yep, yeah. so he is 50 wide by 40 long, or high, I guess is the, the word I'm looking for. So that makes it approximately in case you're wondering, 20 and a half inches by 15 and a half, almost 16 inches. So that'll be an awkward size to try to frame. Um, but that's okay, we'll figure it out. All right, so let's take a look at this drill kit. And this one's also round, which is nice. Um, I actually was on kind of a round kick recently when I've been ordering my diamond paintings because I saw <laughs> when I was reorganizing my stuff that almost all of my diamond paintings were square and square take forever. So it take, they take like twice as long as round. I like square, I do not mind doing square, but if I wanna get something done quicker, it's not gonna be a square. <laughs> so let's take a look at this inventory sheet. Again with the hash mark, so that's good. Tells me someone took a look at it. There is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34 colors. And of course, the majority is black, 310. But this is the image that it's supposed to look like. Kind of a Harry Potter type of thing. Definitely witchy because it does have that pentagram right there. But I, I absolutely love this image. This, this is the image that I wanted. And then I ordered the other one for, I think, because of the discount and then to get free shipping or something like that. Um, I had to pick another one. So that's that. And the same kind of things. They, they, they have the, the baggies with the stamped numbers on them. These tend to be pretty good drills. I cannot complain about the, these drills. The only thing I can usually complain about with these is that sometimes they don't get completely sealed and you end up losing drills out of it. Um, or when they separate them, they cut too far and you end up losing a little bit of drills. Um, I do not see any loose drills inside this bag. Um, there's a ton of 310. It's all right here. Right there. All that 310. A lot of dark colors. And then you've got the light grays. And I'm assuming there's going to be some kind of a white in there. I don't see it. But I'm assuming it's in there somewhere. Because the owl is a white owl. So I would assume that there's some kind of a white or light color. So, yeah. So, so far, Diamond Express seems to be good. Um, obviously, if it was cord glue, it would be better, but that I'm not as concerned about as long as, you know, the canvas arrives nice and any issues that are created after that would be my own fault because of however I stored it or anything like that. Not really... The company's fault if you don't get to it right away and you end up storing it forever but you know so there's that and this again is diamondexpress.com they have an instagram at diamond express and an email at support at diamond di, d m n d express x p r s dot com um 
yeah, so far I say yay. Looks good. So if you like this video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. If you would like to see more of these videos, hit the subscribe button. And as always, thank you for watching and have a great day.